We're here today to walk you through getting started with video units. The first thing that you're going to do is log into your AdSense account. Once you're there, click on the AdSense Setup tab and you'll see that there's a new offering there called Video Units. When you click on the Video Units link, you're going to be taken to a page that explains the offering and gives you an overview of some of its great features. At the bottom, you'll click on a button that agrees to the terms and conditions and you'll be taken to the YouTube sign up page. Once you're there, you'll have to log in with your YouTube username and password. If you don't already have a YouTube username and password, you can sign up and become a member of the fastest growing internet video community. You'll need to have this account before moving forward. Once you've joined or logged in, you'll be taken to a page that asks you to submit your AdSense publisher ID, the last five numbers in your phone number, and your zip code and email address. Once you've done that for your AdSense account, we'll actually merge your AdSense account with your YouTube account so that both of them are working together. The next page you'll land on is the new AdSense player page. Since you don't yet have a player, you'll go ahead and click on the new AdSense player button, which will take you to a page that allows you to build your own customized player for your website. The first thing you want to do on this page is enter in a new player name. You can also add a description in case you want to remember something in particular. For example, where you're going to put it on the site or the type of content that you want in that video player. If you scroll down, you can choose a theme for that player, one of nine different colors. And if you scroll down even farther, you can choose a layout. We've got three different layouts to accommodate all different types of websites and different publisher needs. You have a mini player, a standard player, and also a large player. Once you've chosen the player, you can scroll down and decide how you want the content to show up in your video player. You can choose to have YouTube and Google figure out what's the best content to show on your website. If you choose this selection, Google and YouTube will analyze your site content to determine what the best videos are to show in your site. If you want to give us some help, you can enter in some keyword hints that it will allow us to better optimize which videos we show. If that's not what you want to do, you can choose individual content providers or different categories of content from YouTube providers. Once you've selected either automated content or a provider or category that you're interested in, go down to the bottom and generate your player code by clicking on the button that says Generate Code and copy it to your clipboard. You'll then need to embed this on your website. Once you're done, click the Finish button at the bottom and you'll have created your first new video units player. If you'd like to create an additional player, just click on the New Player button on the left side of the screen. You can create as many players as you want. All we ask is that you put only one player on each page of your site. Thanks, and have a great time with video units.